I love your casual, I love your casual weather terms like soakers. I love it so much. And it's time for your pop break, everybody. Katy Perry and Orlando Bloom are finally parents. Amen. And it turns out Perry's been giving us clues about the baby's name the whole time. After what feels like a two-year pregnancy, Katy Perry has finally announced the birth of her daughter, along with fiancé Orlando Bloom. Apparently, the Daisy singer has been dropping major clues as to the name of the baby all along, and we were all clueless. The pair released a pic of their new family member, Daisy, on Instagram this morning, thanking fans for their well wishes. Katy and Orlando didn't keep the attention focused on themselves for long, though. As UNICEF ambassadors, the couple took the opportunity to advocate for children all around the world who are in danger due to COVID-19. Good for those two ridiculous good-looking people. And everyone knows that if you want to be the lover of a Spice Girl, you've got to get with her friends. Remember the song? Sporty Spice is telling the world the reason that she thinks the girl group was never sexually harassed throughout their career was because men were petrified by them. Mel C said during a recent appearance on a podcast that no one bothered to come near them because you knew if you mess with one of us, you would have to deal with the other four. So we always had backup. Friendship never ends. Amen, ladies. And America's Got Talent held a surprise reunion last night for one of the show's hosts. During a live Q&A, Judge Sophia Vergara took a question from an Ed in Hawaii and was happy to see that it was her former TV husband and Youngstown native, Ed O'Neill. The pair haven't seen each other in months after Modern Family's end earlier this year, so it was an emotional reunion for everyone involved. Time for a reboot, anyone?